it was worthy, not MJ. Patrick Ewing says that he could have easily won two NCAA titles had it not been for James Worthy during the 1981-82 season. Ewing's Hoyas faced the UNC Tar Heels in the championship game that year. While it was MJ who hit the title-clinching basket, Ewing says that the reason why the Tar Heels won the title was James Worthy. Jordan finished with 16 points on 7 of 13 shooting with 9 rebounds, but it was big game James who led the Tar Heels with 28 points on 13 of 17 shooting with 4 rebounds and 3 steals. Sure, the game will always be associated with Michael Jordan's jump shot, but let's not forget that there were still 15 seconds left on the clock when MJ gave the Tar Heels the lead. Georgetown had plenty of time to win the game, but Fred Brown turned the ball over as he threw an errant pass to Worthy. 